hey guys what's up so i just finished filming two videos actually i'm proud of myself and on shoot days i have a bad habit of not even eating before and long after depending on how long the shoot takes but today i finished kind of early wow <laughs> Oh my goodness, where would this H factor ever stop? But today I finished kind of early and I'm about to go have something light. I'll show you guys what I typically have for breakfast these days to get this body, body. <laughs> Let me just show you guys the full fit, okay? Mm -hmm. I have a phone, my phone is here. So, and don't mind all that. But look, I love this pants. Love it's like purple super duper comfortable anyway before i go eat i want to show you guys a couple of things i did around the house yesterday i was so over the moon like even my office you guys can see the change but there is this part that you guys haven't seen and i want to show you but before then let me say thank you to Temu for sponsoring this video because all the things i'm going to be showing you are things that i got off the Temu website in case you're just hearing about Temu for the first time of which i know you're not Temu is an e-commerce website and they specialize in giving you things that number one are super duper affordable and number two you didn't even know you needed in your life because tell me why i'm finding out that there is something called a toilet seat cover it's right here when I'm out and about with my daughter who is four, guys, I always lift up like this. <laughs> just so that obviously she doesn't like sit on the stuff. But with this, I just have to put it and wash my own hands. Did I even know I need that? And then on Thursdays, she has pizza in school. I found something really cute. I'll be putting in a box every Thursday. Look at what it says. Every piece of me loves every piece of you. And it has this little thing, which is cute. So she still takes snacks. But I can just put this with her snacks to enjoy a pizza. <laughs> when I say that you find things you didn't know you needed on the table, this these are things I'm talking about. I still got some decor for my gym space. I'm so excited to fix this up. It didn't come with a frame, but you know, this has scriptures. I'm so excited to fix that up. But in this segment, I'm just going to show you three major things that I was deliberate about. The decor in my office and some to amplify somewhere around the house. I moved over my table to another side of the office and I needed to, you know, amplify the racks there with some decors and I got this ones that are really pretty. And then the place that is now directly behind me, I also got this fancy, you know, just, I don't know what to call it, wall hook with the plant and this fine statue to just accessorize it. Like so simple and yet super duper affordable i love how everything came out together i also went ahead to off you know some parts of the house that were either looking bare or needed some change up which i really love like this beautiful frame a picture of my family is going to be here i super duper love it i got this second dropping plants i already had one there but this second one i was going to put it on the same rack but i realized it'd be nicer on the fridge and look at how beautiful this whole space is right now and just some like items that just make sense so i love that for the decor bit secondly is my car let me guys let me guys tell you something let me tell you guys something for my car the trash in that car i'm telling you me and my nanny I thought about it i can't even lie to you like it is sometimes so disgusting but i'm used to it that's where i just used to pack it and i had to let her know that when you're dealing with kids these are things that come with it but i'm so happy that now i have a car trash and i'm not saying it's going to automatically eradicate the mess that the car will be especially at the back with the kids but the things that i have to throw away at least now i have a spot that is easily accessible for that and then also both my kids they watch screens from time to time i found a way to make it hands free for them so just these two phone hooks that i really love that can even really expand to accommodate an ipad and a seamless the third major segment of things i focused on getting this time are uh, bath materials i usually have bath for my kids like when i say bath like bathtub <laughs> soak bubble bath that's the word i usually have bubble baths for them um every now and then now maybe like once or twice a month and every time i would always find things to make it more interesting i got a fresh mat we can use i got some bath toys some foams and some balls that you know just going to make the place really cute and cozy and nice for them while some music is playing in the background so with all this viewpoint of mine i hope i've been able to convince and not confuse you 
that you need to get on Temu, download the Temu app. Every now and then, for every user, you're able to access products as little as under $1. And if you're an existing user as well, you're also able to get more coupons. And like at the end of the day, it's almost as though you're getting it for free, okay? But talking of free, I have, as usual, a $100 coupon bundle for all users, okay? All you have to do is search the code DKS3572 and you can access it and shop whatever you want. Like at the end of the day, it's almost like you're getting these things for free, okay? Guys, at this point, I am starving. Let's go. Okay. So I'm going to make my typical oats. It's a yummy combination. I'm going to show you guys everything. No judgment, okay? It is fully fit farm. But some of you might feel like, oh, that's too much going on. Everything is healthy for me. I'm bulking up, okay? <laughs> I never thought I would say those words out loud. I'm bulking up. I've already walked. Whatever. But I also have a box of um, green peppers there for Ayamashi maybe tomorrow or later in the week. I'm so excited. But yeah, so first thing is this, my pot and my milk. It's finished. This is what you get for having your pantry downstairs. I just wanted to get the last box of it. Moving on swiftly. So some milk. When I'm doing my oats, I don't like to add milk afterwards. I love for my milk to already have the consistency to be from the fire. That's about the milk I'll use and just a little oats. Yep. So I'm just gonna stir this. It's gonna look like the oats is drowning inside the pot, but by the time it bubbles up and then I add the other things, it will make sense. So stay with me here, okay? Stay with me. <laughs> Next is, I'm going to add some cinnamon. Sometimes I overdo it, okay? But Self-control is important. That's all I add on the fire. Guys, I didn't turn it on. <laughs> when I was going to take the milk, I turned it off and it's just been there anyway. So I'm just going to leave that to cook. Just keep stirring it till the cinnamon dissolves. Like you do Milo, right? Then I leave it to cook while I prep my fruits. First fruit is half of an apple. Just half. We can use the other half tomorrow. So like so. Apple is done. Next is a few grapes. Just cut one in two. And just a bit of red grapes. Also, see why I had to use just a little bit of oats? Because at the end of the day, this is like really filling by itself. Let's check on our oats. At this point, it's bubbling. Maybe I should start a cooking show. This seems fun. <laughs> Whatever. Everything is like acclimatized anyway when your oats start to bubble you know that it is cooked listen i overdid it with the cinnamon for sure as i always do but i like it so whatever so that's the consistency i like to work with half spoon of cinnamon next time to do okay okay baby girl you think that this is the meal we're just getting started this is the base first we're gonna grab some granola okay i love it i try not to go too much with the granola because you know it's healthy but healthy things to have calories even your fruits um and also nuts and if you know you know next is chia seeds i take this with cereal or i take cereal with this pap everything Chia seeds is a really great source of fiber. It keeps you full for longer. Sometimes this is why I'm only able to have this till evening. I mean, right now it's like 2.18. This is my first meal of the day, but that's because I was filming. Normally I eat this around 11 or 12. Next is coconut flakes. Now this is not a staple. It's just something that happens to be at home this time because I wanted to see how it was and my nanny said she liked it. So we bought it actually. That was the main reason we bought it. The next, this depends on, most times I forget the honey, but honey, on a day like today, and that's the meal. Like, how can you say fit fab is all good? How? How can you say fit fab is not even worth it? Like, how will you prefer pizza to this? I'm joking, I eat both. B-O-A-F, both. <laughs> this is actually like the first time I'm having apples with this this week. I always just use the grapes but what I said about it being watery because by the time I mix all of this then I get the consistency I want if you're fit farm 
try this youtube can see what it looks like off ig because i always show that aesthetic looking one on ig stories or whatever but this is what it looks like it's not too bad actually it still looks really healthy really yummy and i'm just going to enjoy that right after i'm done eating i'm going to um go pick the kids my nanny and i will go because i want her to see niagara falls oh uh, since she's living next week uh, by the time you guys are seeing this video i'm sure she would have left many people asked me how did you get your nanny yada, yada. it was very unconventional and i knew that this day will come i knew it was a short-term thing um but she's moving on to greener pastures which i really love for her i do i'm gonna have someone else so the day she leaves i already have plans that someone else comes the part i don't like is having to like go through having to teach them everything but it comes with it right hopefully the person gets it the way this one was able to get it quickly so yes she is indeed leaving she's used exactly two months and four days by the time she's leaving exactly two months with us and um the next person coming to see it's better you have short short term people in this country than nothing at all my life in the last two months i dare to say that i don't know what i would have done with my nanny without my nanny and obviously she's nanny but she also helps like we cook together she helps with the dishes things like that she helps with the laundry things that listen sometimes i look at her and when she says oh i'm so tired i'm like sorry but i'm thinking to myself i used to do all of this while working women are super women women are super women we can bend but we never break okay all right bye okay dogs we're here we just parked and now just finding our way to the falls not Miss she says she wants to go look at the history of the falls she wants to go and read everything i say we are, we are 30 minutes to use here come on sweetheart this way this way anyway here we go mm -hmm. 